George Washington was not the first president of the United States. What? Yeah, I know it sounds crazy, but it's true. Let me explain. July 4th, 1776 is widely accepted as the birthday of the United States of America. But George Washington was not elected president until 1789, which leaves a 13 year gap. So who was in charge of the country during that time? Well, the simple answer is the Continental Congress. And the person who had led that group was called the President of the United States in Congress Assembly. However, this president had little to no power at all. Honestly, they were like a discussion group leader. Only a handful of men served in this presidency, including John Hanson and John Hancock. In 1789, the Constitution came into effect and was used to found a brand and new government in the United States. This new government had an entirely different and more powerful president of the United States. And George Washington was the first person to be elected into that position. So when asked in history class who the first president was, the correct answer is George Washington. But technically, 